Hi guys, it's Siddharth here and it's day 79 of the video challenge. So in this video, I want to basically give you an update on my 90 day uh, goal challenge that I set last week. And I mentioned that basically every week I would give an update in terms of my progress in that area. So I want to start off by saying that um, it's been an interesting week. And in terms of, you know, analyzing the tasks that I set for myself in terms of my three main goals, which was uh, in the fitness side of things, in the business side of things, and the relationship side of things. Um, I found it was a lot tougher than I actually thought it initially would be. So it was almost like a trial week for me. But there's a reason why it's called a challenge. Um, so at least, you know, I'm pushing towards something where I'm actually challenging myself. So if I just basically give a quick summary, um, what I found is I was pretty consistent in terms of my tasks for um, the business side of things. Obviously, there's a lot of motivation there. Um, and, uh, you know, I was able to broadcast as per the frequency I set out for the week to my list. And um, one area that was a bit challenging, which I've dis discussed basically with Greg and Fiona as well, is um, I basically set myself a, a sort of limit of two to three blog posts for my website. And what I found was it was actually a bit of a challenge sort of doing three blog posts a week because, you know, doing a blog itself is not just the writing aspect, it's also the aspect of you know, finding the right information you want to write about because you want to ensure you're providing value. So from that perspective, I found also, you know, if I was to think of a money making activity, I would probably want to spend more time focusing on, you know, working on paid traffic. So what I decided to do is to adjust some of my tasks to sort of, you know, make it more productive for me. Um, I think the key is not to make it easy, but to make it more productive. So rather than focusing and trying to write three pieces of content, which really could be rush pieces of content, it's actually better for me to focus on two, uh, two topics which I could write really quality articles on and provide value on. So that's one of the areas in terms of the business itself. Um, fitness wise, I found that I was able to sort of, you know, be consistent probably 90 to 95% of the time. Um, I did sort of cheat the one day where I was, you know, I said I shouldn't be snacking on a particular day and I did. And I didn't beat myself up about it because I felt, you know, if I start doing that, then I'm really, you know, sort of not realizing that the reason I'm doing this is to grow myself as a person and, you know, grow through this challenge. So, and it's also the first week. So as time goes on, what I'm realizing is that, you know, obviously with your mindset, it does take time to sort of, um, you know, get into a frame of mind where you're consistently doing those tasks. And that's the reason why I mentioned that I'm using an online program to track my progress. Um, so, yeah, for weight wise, I, I lost a bit of weight and then it seems like I'd gained a bit back. So that was a bit of a bummer. But, you know, you head back to the, the task you set out and you just start again. That's how it goes. And, um, you know, relationships wise, obviously, I, you know, I had a good weekend where I spent some quality time with friends. And, um, you know, obviously, from that perspective, you know, I felt that I achieved something in terms of, you know, focusing and building better relationships. So overall, if I was to summarize, um, I would say there was some consistency, but it can get better. And what I'm finding is during the process of doing these tasks in terms of achieving my main goals over the next 90 days, I'm finding actually that I'm actually sort of becoming a person that's, you know, more uh, sort of, if you were to say, present with himself. Uh, it's almost like I'm accepting who I am as a person. I'm accepting love for myself. Um, and generally, I'm just trying to be happy. So... I think I've realized that, you know, it, it's not always about what's going to happen in the future. It's about where you are now as a person and what you're trying to do as a person and whether you accept where you are, but you accept it with the sense of knowing and purpose and belief and happiness. So that was a great revelation for me during the week. 
Um, so yeah, I thought I'd just share those results. And hopefully, you know, in the next week when I share my progress, I can actually give you some more good news in terms of that aspect. So guys, I would suggest it's really something to look at. Um, if you feel you really want to start off 2016 with great momentum, then I really suggest you create your own 90 day goals. And you know, it's, it's, it's a great challenge for you as a person. I mean, the only way you really grow is if you keep challenging yourself. So yeah, there's my insights. I will see you in the next video. Take care.